Hey, what is happening? What is going on? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you're doing well. And if you're new here, welcome to the channel. Hopefully, you enjoy the video and consider subscribing if you enjoy the video and if you want to. Okay, so one dreaded thing to create in Blender is water or like a realistic water. So I was um, watching YouTube videos and I came across Max Hayes' recent YouTube video where he explains how he creates water. And I thought I would do like a step by step tutorial on how he creates it because it's brilliant and realistic and probably the best water I've seen. So if you haven't subscribed to his channel, I'll link it below. Give him a, a subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, without further ado, let me show you. Okay, so in Blender, first thing you want to do is you don't want to create a plane, you want to create a cube. Okay, then scale it up a bit, go here, and just squash it down like that and then maybe scale it up a bit more, something like that, so maybe a bit smaller, perfect. Okay, so now we're going to create water like this, first thing we're going to do is cl click on it, go to shading and then click new. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this, select this and just shift it away. Okay, so first thing, we're going to add a bump node. Plug this into the normal. And then add a musgrave texture. And plug this into the heart. Okay. Now we're going to set the scale to 230, strength 0 0.05, distance 0 0.02. Now we're going to go here to roughness, bring this all the way down, bring the transmission all the way up. And then you'll see if I do this, I've unplugged it, but plug this into here. You can see this kind of looks decent kind of like water but he does a couple of adds other a couple of other nodes to make it even better so let me show you what he does first thing i'm going to add is a mix shader and then a transmission and transmission transparent sorry plug this in here and then Shift this. What do I do? I just plug this one to the top one. Plug this to the surface. Okay, and then plug this BSDF into there. And now what we're going to do is add a light path. Click on here and then plug the camera ray to there. And then we are almost done. Last thing we're going to do, go at a principal volume, change this to 0.123, plug the volume to the volume, and now we've got a bit of water. Okay, and that's basically it. So I'll go in here. Actually, I'm going to go here, bring in a atmosphere, and you can see how nice it looks. And then you can obviously play with the, the roughness and stuff, change the water, but it looks good. I think it looks great. It's got that last ripple effect. Now shine, and then if you want to save it to your asset library, just click on it, go here, say mark as asset, then what you want to do is go here, save as, look for your asset library, mine is over here, and then just save it, 
so i've resaved mine but i'll save it again and then if you go new go to your asset library bring this up one here and there's my water and you bring it in and there we go and it looks good so don't forget to subscribe to Max's channel and hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, maybe tell him I sent you and I'll see you in the next one.